people keep asking me what I think about this jelly roll thing, I have to clear up any rumors and any because y'all love doing that gossip shit. God don't like it. I don't play games. I'm not playing about a set of dice, deck of cards, radio, balls, game, soccer, none of that. I'm not playing. I'm not Raptor type. I'm really not the one you want sitting at this spot because I jack it off. Like, I, I'm, I get stupid when I get angry. So, I know, okay, in my career, I'm gonna make it this far. Cause I didn't go left, I didn't go right, I went straight. That means I was intending on God and y'all to push me to the point of maintaining relevance and staying relative. Uh, I want everybody that comes out with my assistance to be bigger than me. Like, see, and that makes me a rarity because most people, oh yeah, they want you to do good, but they don't want you to do better than them. And when you start doing a little bit better than them, they turn into haters like everybody else. No, I want to see man do well. I want to see them excel. So, smoke. Zeke, that's why I call him Zeke, like Ezekiel. Zeke was designed to go straight over to Warner Brothers. Hey, I'm Big Spo, I'm here for my country rap deal. And they was gonna give him one. I love Spo, I want it. and he did way better. Like, can't nobody take it away from dude. Like, chronological order, he was the second, right? Like, artist to get to a big level in country rap, of course, behind Cold Four, who was first. See, y'all can argue and bicker your points about who was better or who did it this way or who did it that way, but you can't remove chronological order. You can't change chronological order. That's what you can't do. Smo, who didn't come into my life till like 2008 and left in 2009, but Jelly came into my life in like, 2099 and uh, I remember because I was dating Gotti's mama at the time and uh, we met at a car show and we got all these Hummers and Corvettes and big uh, $100,000 pickup trucks back then and uh, he looking like Jelly was looking like, which one of these joints do I jump in? And we bail out and go cut out. And I was like, nah, little bro, you gotta finish that time. You gotta do that time. And then when you get out, we are gonna keep up. And we did, and you know, he just, the formula for everybody that I work with is for them to be bigger than me. See, in my opinion, it's some people, I ain't gonna say no names, but y'all know who I'm talking about. So, I wanted Smo to be big. I wanted Jelly to be big. But the thing is, honest to God, I saw Jelly really feeling the haystack void more so than going totally a rap. When you put the word a before something, it denounces the following word if you wasn't paying attention in English. So, I wasn't expecting them to go, but this country music city, baby, if we're gonna get love from radio, if we're gonna get love at a, 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 on Music Road, man, we better come over and talk about somebody say, like, we can't come over there like, I was riding in a cutlass, rocking my necklace, don't worry about what I had for breakfast. Man, them country boys don't wanna hear that. So he took all the rap out. He does a great job at representing the demographic. And you ain't got to like him, but you got to get used to him because the fat kid's here to stay. And yeah, man, if I made any contribution, which there's no arguing that, uh, thank God I didn't give all my pearls to pigs. That one line something. And I'm proud, I, I, I can't tell you how proud I am, because tomorrow, maybe Saturday night, you'll be on Saturday Night Live, and I'll be even proud. But right now, I'm pretty damn proud. Good morning, America, and all these achievements that he's done. 
I always say if it's working for you, keep doing it. You know what I'm saying? And now to clear up any rumors and because y'all love doing that gossip shit. God don't like it. Look at Proverbs uh, six, seven abominations before God in Proverbs. Google that. Number six, talking all that gossip. So, but you know, people say, what do you think about that jelly roll singing thing? And I'm like, See, man, you either are paying attention or you ain't. But if you're paying attention, you know, in 2014, which was 13, which is 10 years ago, he put out that, let me light a cigarette, give me a beer, it's Sunday morning. Yep, my baby. He put that joint out 10 years ago. So, obviously, he been critiquing it and working it and twerking it to get it, tweaking it to get it right. So, yeah, man, shout out. And it's love. How, how else would anybody think I possibly feel about Kenna? Like, that's my little brother.